So now let's do a simple wipe animation inside of Cinema 4D. To do the wipe animation, I'm going to bring in an object right over here, like this figure, just like that. And to use the wipe animation effect, I'm going to use the bully tool. So to use the bully tool, I'm just going to go over here and bring in another object. So I'm going to bring in something uh, like this spear right here. So now I'm going to apply the bully tool right over here. So I'm going to go inside here. Uh, let me find the bully tool. So inside here, you can see that there's bully. Let me just apply that. And I'm going to uh, drag in the spear there and the figure. So now you can see that the spear is acting as the bully. And to do the wipe animation, simply drag on and you can see that this, the wipe actually happens. So this is actually just using the boolean tool and you can see that the wipe animation simply happens just like that. So I can actually make some object appear or disappear. So let me just increase the size of the spear right here and I'm going to do a wipe animation. So let's say about 20 seconds right over here and now you can see my object is inside the spear and what I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, add in something. Um, I'm going to add in a keyframe, an automatic keyframe so it's easier to animate and this is the position right over here and then on the 20th frame I'm just going to drag it up. So now you have an animation. Seems like there's no animation over here. Okay, so there is animation. The automatic keyframe works. So if I were to play it, you can see that this is the type of animation that you get. Let me just increase the frame rate to around 40 so that you can see everything else. So now if I were to go over here and press the play button, you can see that the animation happens. There's the white animation right over there. To make it interesting, let me just add in a floor and let me add in uh, an environment, a physical sky, just like this. And I'm going to go on to the render setting on the standard. Let me select something like uh, 640 by 480 right over here. So it's render renders fast. I'm going to render all of the frames right here and let's render it out and see how that looks like. So now uh, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to uh, render this out. So press the render button. I'm going to press yes. I don't want to save it right now and you'll be able to see that it renders out frames. So let me just fast forward this really quick and it's rendered out now. So if I were to press the play button right here, you can see that this is the animation that you get. You see the shadows and everything else, the wipe effect actually happens. So you can do this to any number of objects. So you can do, you can bring in multiple objects and do wipe animation just like that. So that is how you can pull off a wipe animation using Cinema 4D. Hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.